We just published our 2017 Superbike Shootout and the most common response so far has been but we know s one k r r u dummies. The reason why, as you'll know if you paid any attention to words in the first part of that comparison, is that we traditionally don't bring back bikes that haven't been updated and didn't win the previous shootout to come and lose again. And while that stunts is up for debate, but please, God, not here. This increasingly infuriating comment illustrates something else much more valuable than people's poor reading comprehension. People love the BMW S1000RR, the current S1000RR under the lights at Qatar. BMW first launched the S1KRR in 2008 to compete in WSPK, and then released as a production model to the public in 2010. That year, it demolished the competition, easily winning out 10 best superbike of the year. Since then, it's seen only minor updates. This last year seeing changes to the emissions for Euro 4 standards and electronics added as standard. But besides that, things like the motor and chassis have remained unchanged. Despite being a little long in the tooth, though not as long as the Honda and Suzuki were until this year, the BMW has remained a favorite amongst riders everywhere. California Superbike School uses them for their schools with great success. They still do well every year at the Isle of Man PT. And we still get hounded every time we leave them out of a story by people who've experienced them and love them. The fact of the matter is, we think there are other things that are suitable for the market.